EV site can be used to perform a wide variety of analysis and basic data overlays to more complex filtering queries and statistical visualization. It brings together a wide variety of data layers and analysis tools to help make better, faster and more profitable EV siting decisions. In this example, using EV site, we'll identify which locations are unsuitable for EV chargers and then which locations offer good opportunity for EV charge points based on site suitability and projected charge point utilisation. We start by ruling out unsuitable sites. Here we can see pavements colour-coded according to their suitability. Red is ruled unsuitable either because of the presence of obstructive street furniture or because the pavement is too narrow to support most EV charge points. Amber highlights areas where a site visit may be required and green are pavements which are highly suitable for an EV charger. Next, we can overlay flood data to understand which streets are at greatest risk of future flooding. In seconds, we can rule out hundreds of unsuitable locations, saving hours of work and avoiding time-consuming site visits. Now, we want to understand the sites where placing an EV charger represents a good investment for charge point and operator and the local population. That means places where vehicles are regularly parked for 30 minutes or more, schools, car parks, train stations, taxi ranks and other points of interest are available to overlay and scan in EV site. On top of that, network data layers allow you to rapidly identify which substations and feeder cables have sufficient capacity for an EV charge point. This saves weeks of time spent sending data requests and can massively reduce the cost of connection by highlighting areas where there is already sufficient capacity for EVs. Or, if you want to simplify things further, we've done the analysis for you using points of interest, population census information, traffic data, and a model trained on historic charge point usage data. We've highlighted sites with high forecast utilization rates and included information on the model charging needs of residents now and into the future, so you know where to site rapid, fast, or ultra-fast chargers. EV Sites includes an array of other layers that help narrow down the search further or respond to government funding grants. Household income data and the availability of off-street parking is available to premium users. Additional data layers, like public transport accessibility levels, tell you how well connected a group of residents are to the public transport network. Users can also quickly and simply upload and display their own data to supplement their analysis. Speak to Advanced Infrastructure today to understand how EV sites can use data and geospatial analysis to accelerate your energy transition.